Numbers were used thousand of years before we used zero. Before one there is only void, or non-being. Begins with meaning such as, non-existence, nothingness, the unmanifest, the unlimited, the eternal. The absence of all quality or quantity. Zero is both a number and a numerical digit used to represent that number in numerals. Zero is the integer that precedes the positive one, and follows minus one. Zero is an integer which quantifies a count or an amount of null size. If something has a weight of zero, it has no weight. The modern numeral zero is normally written as a circle or rectangle. The word zero comes through the Arabic literal translation of the Sanskrit zunya, the actual word zero came from Italy. By the mid-second millennium BC, the Babylonians had a sophisticated sexagesimal positional numeral system. The lack of a positional value was indicated by a space between sexagesimal numerals. The Babylonian placeholder was not a true zero, because, it was not used alone. Early use of something like zero by the Indian scholar Pingla, implied at first glance by his use of binary numbers, is only the modern binary representation using zero and one applied to Pingla's binary system, which used short and long syllables, making it similar to Morse code. Egyptian hieroglyphics were used as early as 3500 BC. Egypt did not have zero. Even without zero, Egyptians became masters of mathematics. Around 500 BC, the Greeks developed a newer sophisticated number system. Roman also have a number system. Roman 87 LSCI, requires seven symbols with several repeats. Still, the Egypt Greek and Roman number systems had no zeros. By 130 AD Platimi was using a symbol of zero. It was used alone and hence was the first documented use of the number zero in the old world. The oldest known text to use zero is the Jain text from India entitled the Lokavibhaga, dated 458 AD. In 498 AD, Indian mathematician and astronomer Aryabhata stated that sthanam sthanam dasagunam or place to place in ten times in value, which may be the origin of the modern decimal based place value notation. Hindu culture had a positional number system in base 10. They used a dot to represent an empty place. 
Arabic people recognized the value of the Hindu system. They adapted the numerals and computation then spread the ideas in their travels. Europeans resisted Hindu Arabic numerals. The numerals, including zero, were not accepted. The Italian mathematician Leonardo of Pisa, also called Fibonacci, was instrumental in bringing the system into European mathematics in 1202. Zero is neither positive nor negative, neither a prime number nor a composite number, nor is it a unit. It represents the boundary between the negative and the positive numbers. The most common practice throughout human history has been to start counting at one. Nevertheless, in computer science zero has become the standard starting point. For example, in almost all old programming languages, an array starts from one by default. As programming languages have developed, it has become more common that an array starts from zero by default, the first item in the array being item zero. In particular, the popularity of the programming language C in the 1980s has made this approach common. Yet, we always start counting with one. 